18. It's quite a drop. <laughs> Very <laughs> cool, moment. yes. Jody's back again. Some poignant uh, tape to show us. Yes, rather than uh, play of the day, Tony, mm. some nostalgia for you tonight as we bid adieu to an icon. The man who hit the fame shot heard around the world, Bobby Thompson, has passed. He was 86. Thompson's claim to fame was the three-run home run in the bottom of the ninth inning that won the 1951 National League pennant for the New York Giants. Here it is. The magical moment took place when Thompson connected off Brooklyn ace Ralph Hawk Branca in the decisive game of a best-of-three playoff series at Polo Grounds. Such memories for baseball fans. It was a long time ago, 1951, and I do not recall. I'm not a great baseball fan, but that was an historic moment. The and shot heard around the world. I know, and people in the studio knew exactly what you were talking about. When Indeed you started, they so. did. There are some statisticians here. <laughs> That's all the time we have tonight. We'll be back tomorrow night at 5. We'll see you then. Good night. Good night. Whether you can sleep in... Yes, Get a rest. that's right. You don't have to worry about those high temperatures we've been having in the last little while. We've been watching these guys for the last three weeks. They're great players, and they celebrate really well, and they're so inventive. They're incredible. This is pretty neat, actually. Yeah. These Icelandic soccer players, it's a little bit of fun for you, some fodder from these media darlings, really, these soccer media darlings from Iceland. Uh, they're at it again. The Starhan soccer team from Iceland, they brought us such celebratory gems as the battlefield and the big catch. Well, now they're adding to their repertoire. Here are a couple more for you. This is the ever-popular Michael Phelps impersonation. Call it competitive swimming on the pitch, perhaps? The dive and the stroke. And then when you think, what could they, how do they follow that up? Even more creative choreography. Watch this. They, they score, then they celebrate. Okay, it's like, what are we doing, guys? Oh, hey, okay, you sit here, and then, okay, we'll go. The six-man rowing celebration <laughs> how the purists will disapprove and how the children will celebrate this form of on-field antics what will they think of next that's what we look forward to you're right they will think of something next and it'll be bigger and better than what we just saw and that's why we keep watching <laughs> icelandic <laughs> soccer players they, are, they really are amazing it's, it's, fun. it's fun we'll be back tomorrow at five o'clock we'll see you then have a good evening good night from all of us but for the next five days, temperatures remaining below seasonal. Got to love the PNE, right? <laughs> <laughs> urban myth. Urban myth, yeah. absolute okay. urban or myth. Or fact, depending yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> and Jody has a final item. Yes, and it's kind of a fun one for you. YouTube sensations, the legendary shots, might have topped everyone with their latest challenge. Making a basket from, well, new heights, kind of PNE esque here. Check this out. Let's kiss your spot. Hey, I'll make the first one to the red. Count three, two, one, Let's off. do it. This time, 17-year-old John Massey makes a shot while riding the Stratosphere at an Alabama amusement park. This thing sends people 185 feet in the air. This shot is being estimated at about 130 yeah. feet up from the ground. He does admit that it took him about 25 tries to make that bucket. Still so they, pretty amazing. And we'll they kept going tomorrow. up and up? Or did they do that once? Times. 25 times. <laughs> times. Back tomorrow at 5. Good night. Good night. <laughs>quite nice towards the middle of the work week. We like that. That's good. Cool. Thank you very much, Claire. Final word, a little item from sports from Jody. We do have something a little bit fun for you today. You don't often see something like this. The baseball fan who goes for food mid-inning ends up with a souvenir. Hmm. Check this out. This is from last night's Giants-Phillies game off the uh, Jason Worth foul ball. This Phillies fan, look at this. <laughs> One-handed oh, grab nice. doesn't spill a beverage. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you wait cool. That's kind of cool. And little known fact, yes. I met Claire at a baseball game. Oh, really? Yeah. Yes. Oh. I was probably the worst person you could possibly have at a baseball game because I leaned into Joni and I said, okay, so it's like rounders, right, in England. Mm -hmm. And you sighed. I was like, okay, where <laughs> do we start with this? <laughs> this is going to be a long game. Beer. Yeah. Beer, <laughs> exactly. Our yeah. favorite part of the PNE. Who's got a favorite? 
Uh, the roller coaster, the rattly old roller coaster. Oh, really? Yeah. Fried yeah. onions on a burger. <gasps> and I like the little donuts. Are they actual donut holes, aren't they? Tom Thumb yeah. donuts. Yeah. They're actually mm. the little. All the little yeah. tiny donuts, yeah. Wow, you people great. know way too much about food than I do. I know. <laughs> We're just <You> hungry. <laughs> and the Peony has had an amazing run. It's 100 years old, and it starts, well, it actually starts with a parade tonight at 7 o'clock downtown, and we'll be covering that, as you heard from, uh, yeah. from our reporters. And uh, it's going to be a great run we hope the great run and it. you know what the yeah. forecast is only looking bad for the first weekend saturday we'll see the cloud rolling sunday's the best chance to shower so probably a wet start to the parade or to the uh the day on sunday but after that it smartens up and brightens up beautifully it's a big urban myth that it rains throughout the entire week. Even yeah. if it rains at the Peony, you can go inside and see true. the animals, yep. take the kids. It's a great spot for the little ones. Ride and the roller coaster in the rain. And sure. Justine Ma will have parade coverage later tonight. That's it for us. We'll be back Monday at 5 o'clock. Enjoy your weekend. Good night. See you later.